Hello friends, welcome to Spice the Mall. I am your host Nitin. And after exploring the seaside areas of Kuta and Seminyak, we are heading to Ubud, the art, culture, heritage capital of Bali. And on the way, you will see all these beautiful artworks. So there are a lot of places who do these beautiful artworks in Ubud. So first stop for today will be the Batuan Temple. And it is always better to take blessings from the God and start your day. Well, just from the distance itself, the temple structure looks quite large, magnificent and you need to pay the entry charges and wear the sarong. So we did all those formalities. And we have put so beautiful balnies in our clothes. So for that, they have already made an arrangement where you can do the photography. So we click a few pictures. Here and then headed towards the main temple complex. As soon as you entered the temple complex, the peace, tranquility, positiveness, and the cleanliness of it, it just so good. You feel so much better as soon as you enter. The inner areas of the temple has these structures where they have kept all the decorations they use for the puja and the prayers and all the utensils different instrument they use during the festival so all of them you can check one by one It is not just the tourists, we could see a lot of locals also had come and they were taking blessings from the God. After appreciating this beautiful Batuan temple, it was time to head for our next adventure in Ubud. A perfect way to explore the green terrain of Ubud is ATV bikes or quad bikes. And there are a lot of centers in Ubud. We also headed for one to explore this adventure. And Ganpati Bappa ko namaskar karke hum gaye andar to negotiate the price make sure if you are not booked online you negotiate with them for a good deal and generally they do reduce prices little bit and then it was time to wear the kit for ATV ride now there were gumboots and for socks they gave us polythene bags so kafi tagda jugad tha inka cost bachane ka but that was very practical so please remember it's a group activity and generally there are 10 to 15 quad bikes which go together for this activity and one by one you cross to different levels of difficulty. So before they explain us all the safety precautions. As soon as the group enter the rice field, the adventure begin. The trail is not easy but it is super fun. It takes almost one and or one and a half hour for the entire activity. They have this cave structures. They have special pits where they have a lot of muds through which you can take the quad bikes. It is super fun. If you come to Ubud, do not miss this activity. Your Ubud trip is incomplete if you do not visit those natural waterfalls. So today on the list was Teganangan Fall. Well. After paying the mandatory entry charges, you come across this large shopping area, touristy area. That means a lot of tourists come here. And near the entrance itself, you have this viewpoint from where you get the complete bird's eye view of the waterfall 
the entire valley and the flora and fauna surrounding the waterfall. The actual fall is around 15 minutes walks down the hill from here but you could still hear the flow of water at such a distance as well. And if you want to spend the day relaxing next to this beautiful greenery and waterfall, you got Oma Day Club next to it. I mean, we had a limited time, so we just decided to click some beautiful pictures here and move to our next destination. So our stay in Ubud was at this beauty Balinese resort called the Munut Resort. Very close to that was another attraction of Ubud called Champuhan Ridge Walk. Now this ridge walk is something which is you just go inside the natural trail and explore the beauty around it and the greenery around it. And this temple at the entry of the walk, the entire trail, it just looked like you are part of some treasure hunt Hollywood style movie. I mean the greenery is so beautiful and there is a calmness, a very peacefulness. A lot of people come for this walk in the evening especially and early morning. It's around 2 kilometers in total if you want to do it. We did a part of it. It's a fully paved path, so anyone can do it very easily. As you come on the top of the hill, the view gets even better. You could see the rice fields, some of the palm plantations at a distance. And it is one of those experiences to explore pure natural beauty of Ubud. You should not miss. As we were ending our trek, we realized it's been a hectic day and we could do with a very good Balinese full body massage. And there are a lot of centers who offer these therapies in and around center of Ubud. So as you, we were coming out of the, the ridge walk, just across the street, there was this massage parlor and we decided to avail their services and enjoy a Balinese massage. So friends, don't forget to like the video, share it with your family and friends, subscribe to channel Spice the Mall and until we meet again with fantastic videos like this, stay happy, stay healthy and keep traveling.